Hey, it might be deer hunting season right now, but it's also open enrollment for choosing your health benefits plan for 2020, uh, if you want to change it. Now, I don't know about you, but I have a better shot, pun intended, to bag an 18-point buck, if there is such a thing, than successfully choosing a health benefit plan and possibly saving myself some bucks. Mine. So I did, like everybody should be doing right now, go online, check out your plan, see if you want to change it during open enrollment. Well, I go on the website to look at my options that I chose for this year, and then I notice, boom, right there on the main menu, I only have three days left to keep what I have. Well, thank goodness, just the other day, I saw this article in Mimi. Boom. It's about this guy, Carl Lishing of Health Markets Insurance Agency in Lakewood, and he offers health benefit guidance or even Medicare guidance for free which happens to rhyme with three, which is the amount of days I have left to do my open enrollment. Now, in this article, Carl says you sit down with him, you go over different health plans. Some will be better than what you have. Some will be less than what you have. Some will cost more. Some will cost less. Or maybe pay the same, but you get more. Some new plans will let you keep the doctor you prefer. Some won't because they might not be in the network. But as we all know, a health benefits plan isn't a one-size-fits-all kind of thing. And it said in the article, Carl provides hundreds of different options to consider. And this is cool because health market agents don't work for just one insurance company. He'll get his little something-something from the company that you choose that's best for you. Perfect. So I went and checked them out because I only had three days left. He's on Detroit Road in Lakewood. All right, this is Carl Lishing. He is not a friend of mine. No offense, Carl. But, uh... I just learned of him too because it's open enrollment and I have no idea what to do and you come recommended and I'm really glad I used you. So that's the only reason why I'm interviewing you now and promoting right. you. Well, thank you. <laughs> and he's not paying for this if anyone thinks he is. But how much would you pay for this post if you were going to pay for it? Carl? It depends on how, what kind of results I get. <laughs> All right. Let's just give somebody a tip that's experienced the same thing I did and I called you a week ago. It's open enrollment. What do we at least basically need to know? Uh, you have till December 15th to choose a plan if you're under 65 years of age. If you're on Medicare, you got till December 7th. Um, it's a good idea to review and take into consideration the medications that you take and if there's something that's going to be a good fit. Yeah. Um, and make a choice. If the best choice is to stay where you're at, stay yeah. where you're at. If there's something better, we can help make adjustments. Yeah, I wish you would have adjusted your chair prior to me interviewing you because I would have had health markets in the whole time during the shot. Oh. But don't worry, I got it there at the end. All right, real good. I have one more question before I leave. Sure. You're the recipient of at least uh, eight Golden Eagle Awards, some are silver. What are these uh, awards, these trophies of eagles? Well, it means you do a good job. You write a lot of business, take care of a lot of people, and <laughs> that's about what it means. All right, I'm going to show them real fast. Thanks, Carl, for all your help, man. All right, my pleasure. Here's to 2020. Amen. May I never have to use anything I just bought. Absolutely. <laughs> all right, now here quickly are the eagles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Why did I say eight? There must be another one somewhere. There it is. And by the way, he has some of these. This is what he's paying me in. This is what he's paying me in. And the waters. I'm taking the waters with me. Taking all the waters. Shh. Hey, if you do happen to go see uh, Carl, uh, let him know that his business card refrigerator magnets, uh, they don't work on wood panel refrigerator doors. See, so, sorry, Carl. <laughs>